and welcome back to my channel where I tend to talk about fashion and beauty and maybe some plants and pottery at some point. In today's video I'm going to be showing you an ASOS haul that I did earlier on this week. It's the first time I've tried it on so I've filmed beforehand all my try-ons and now I'm going to talk about it. And I'll insert the clips when I'm talking about the certain piece. You know the drift of how these kind of hauls go. Specifically this haul is real life so I'm not keeping it all because some of it doesn't look what it was meant to look like and all that jazz. So if you want to watch me try on some stuff from ASOS and decide whether or not I'm keeping it or not then keep on watching. Okay so the first item I was so close to keeping but it's a jumpsuit okay. So first of all it's a jumpsuit <laughs> and it's in this like sage green colour it's kind of this like really loose linen but it's not linen material um it has a open back kind of vibe as you can see um and that's the front nice and loose and cool which i thought would be perfect for spring and summer um unfortunately i have a really long body so i struggle getting jumpsuits and bodysuits which this one's like one of the only bodysuits i have um, to actually fit me properly otherwise they do this thing where they kind of like they don't fit to my body properly they gap at the back um, and this one did it slightly too much like it was it was close and you can see in the photo that it does kind of look quite cute um, it's more comfort vibes and it kind of just like makes places that I don't want to stand out stand out um, so it's a no from me um, but it was it's cute and also it's quite expensive it's like 30 quid um, and I just don't think it's worth it when I'm not 100% sure on it completely so that's a no from me next piece is another complete no from me and this is for many reasons it's a pair of jeans from daisy street on there um, and i got them because they looked like really good quality and they were a nice dark blue i will show you what they look like on asos's website now i don't know if i've been sent the complete wrong pair of jeans or if they've really just changed how they look in the picture so the color is a complete no the material is really thin and I'm not into thin jeans, I need nice thick jeans and I'm not saying I need expensive jeans, my jeans I have currently are from Collusion which were only like 20 quid and they are nice thick and they fit. These also didn't fit, they're a size 12 and I'm always a size 12 um, and they wouldn't even like go over my ass, and that's just like a no for me obviously. Not much else to say on them, I didn't take a video of me in them because you'd have seen all my private parts so let's go no with those next piece i am th i think i'm keeping i'm not quite sure I, I don't really have the money but i think i'll get a lot of wear out of them and it is these it's like a jumpsuit but it's like a dungaree jumpsuit and it has like a really wide leg i'll show you the what it looks like obviously i really love the color they fit which is a miracle because like i said jumpsuits don't often fit me and these fit they also have this like adjustable tie waist which means i can get them to like where i want them to sit perfectly also they're just perfect for you know going out in the summer and spring let's hope that i'm allowed out of the house so i can actually wear them but they're also probably really good to just wear around the house when it's really hot and you just don't like want to wear anything yeah i'm really happy with those i think i persuaded myself to keep them my mum really likes them if my mum likes something then that means they're quite nice next you would have also seen this in the video of the jumpsuit dungaree thing and it's this cute little sage top i really like it i'm gonna keep it because i really wanted something in a sage color it's got these cute little thumb holes which i just love thumb holes um, I haven't got anything with thumb holes and I've always wanted something with thumb holes. So now I've got something with thumb holes. And I just, yeah, I just really, really think it's cute. It's just like nice fit. I wore it with a like a proper under wide bra with the dungarees. But then I realised it's a little bit short for me to do that. So I put a bralette on and it was much better. Um, so yeah, I really like this and I'll probably be wearing that a lot recently. I'm a bit gutted this doesn't fit, but I had a feeling this wouldn't fit, and it's this um, pinafore kind of, oh, that's confusing, pinafore skirt dress thing, just too short, I'm just too tall, I'm not even that tall, I'm 5 foot 9, I'm 5 foot 9, I'm a size 12, but my issue is I have a really long body and short legs, so it just doesn't bode well when I have like a really high waist as well, so not only am I like really long bodied, my waist where I like to have everything cinched in, is really high too so I have a high waist a long body and short legs and it's just not a good mix when like things don't fit properly so I do struggle with skirts and dresses as well 
I really liked the pattern of this, but no, it just didn't fit. And you can see it's very short. Um, it can't. I can't pull it any lower. I tried to make the you can uh, the straps are adjustable. Sorry. So I tried to make it longer, but it just wasn't big enough for me to put it lower. So yeah, just a no. Next are my two favourite pieces, but I'm going to have to choose between them because they're both jumpers and I don't need two jumpers in when it's nearly March and it'll be spring soon and um, it's not jumper weather anymore. Um, so the one that I did like a little um, test photo shoot just to see which one I preferred and I think I prefer the last one I'm going to show you. So this is the one I'm not going to keep, even though this is kind, this does have my heart and I think my mum would love me to keep it, but it just is a bit out there for my style, but it's this jumper it's in the men's section because like, ASOS's women jumper section sucks I was looking for like a bold print big print jumper and ASOS didn't have that much for on the women's side so I went on to, I went on to the man's part of the site and they had loads to choose from and I picked these two out because these just were like the ones that stood out for me really um but yeah so it's got this gorgeous like pink palm print and oh see now I'm like considering it because I love leaves like I'm a plant person and this has got leaves all over it I really love this maybe I should keep both but like mum said it was sensible to not keep both but like isn't it just so gorge I, I, I tried it on with two different trousers like jeans and trousers and it just looked really cute and I really like it but like I don't I don't have a reason to keep both I don't know we'll see <laughs> last jumper and I actually do think it is my favorite jumper it's not my mum's favorite jumper but for some reason I'm drawn to it and it's this one one it's softer inside so that one's like as rough as it is outside as it is as it is as it is inside but this one is softer and it's got these really cute little mushrooms with eyes on them and it's just so like fairy and also it's neutral and we all know i'm a neutral gal um, i'm gonna wear this today actually i'm going for a walk so i'm gonna wear it on top of this and hope that keeps me warm enough but I just love, and I really love this neck, like this little, I just, yeah, I, this one does have my heart, so I'm probably going to have to send the other one back. Maybe, it, maybe I'll ask for it again. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll reorder it. <laughs> I'll get my mum to buy it or my boyfriend. But yeah, that really cute. And that's like the last piece of my haul. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment which, which jumper you actually prefer. Um, I'd be, I'd like to see which one wins. Subscribe to my channel if you want to keep seeing hauls and fashion and beauty videos and I'll see you next time. Bye guys. Thanks for watching